Hi, there's somebody here that you're connected into who wants to mend some fences with you. They want to mend, you know, build some bridges back towards you, okay? Okay, I think this person is feeling very small, small about something at the moment, but they would like to extend an olive branch okay so i'm going to go into that in more depth for you firstly i'm going to see what they'd like to say okay um and then i'll have a look at the past what else comes out also the environment intentions advice for you so have a good look at this all right like i said they want to mend some they want to build some bridges mend some fences that kind of energy um this has been going on for a while. This is quite, I think this is quite a strong out, long ending. Okay, this wasn't, I'm not getting a particularly quick ending to something here. It was quite a protracted ending. Okay, right, so let's see what else we can find out for you today. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're all okay. It's nice to see you again. If you would like a personal reading, all that I wanted to come out, if you just click click on the title of the video, uh, the link's in the description box, and also the free relationship reports in there as well. Go check that out. I'm going to take two more cards, okay? Okay, let's see what they've got to say. Right, the one that flew out is the reunion card they're regretful that's what i was getting i feel they feel very small um and they want to tell you the truth about something okay they'd like a reunion they wish whatever they did wherever they've gone whatever happened here never happened okay they want to tell you the truth about something so i'm going to get into this now and see what's going on here you know are they, are they genuine that kind of stuff you know what's See if we can find, see what's going on. Okay, let's have three more for their feelings, please. Special person's energy, energy, please. Right, okay. Oh. Okay, yep. Yeah. Your person really regrets the gossip. There was some gossip that went on here um could have been an air sign okay there's some slander just some general immaturity okay if there was another person that was gossiping about you that they didn't defend you against or they listened to this other person when you told them not to you know that kind of energy they are regretting this all right they are regretting this very very much they're also regretting making the decision they made okay they regret not realizing what they had with you all right the this is somebody who's not always satisfied okay one foot in one foot out i think they thought that you know going somewhere else or doing something else was going to be more exciting for them all right they they regret this they regret making that decision. I feel very strongly today that somebody regrets a lot of damage that they did, okay? But not just during while, not just whilst you were together, but even since you separated, somebody regrets the damage they've done. They definitely regret allowing other people to have too much say on how this relationship went, all right? You know, <laughs> Somebody had your person's ear, all right? Some, somebody had their ear and was filling them full of um, nonsense, gossip, bitchiness, ugh, horrible, horrible, horrible stuff, tittle-tattle, childish, childish, childish energy. They wish that had never happened, okay? They're going to come back in, reveal, I want to tell you the truth, it's the Knight of Swords, okay? I will say that the Knight of Swords is a very fast energy. It's an energy of someone who doesn't have a plan. You know, some you know, it's that energy of you wake up in the morning 
and you know four hours later you're on a plane okay you're going somewhere different you haven't actually formulated a plan basically i feel what's going to happen here is it's all just going to come out all right your person's literally just going to wake up one day blah everything they want to speak their truth they want to tell you the truth because the Knight of Swords is all about getting your point across. It's a very hasty, impatient energy, okay? Your person will cut through everything to speak the truth here. Again, this card sometimes can mean that this is a sort of person who only has their point of view, you know, when somebody... <laughs> and somebody just has their truth and it's their world viewpoint and that's it okay that's it a lot of air here Aquarius Libra Gemini okay possibly Aries as well all right but there's a you know the cards that have come out even just in the tarot are the fast moving energetic cards all right your person's been thinking about this for a while I think for some of them, they've been almost, they don't want, didn't want to upset the status quo where they are, okay? They could be in a situation where they're relatively comfortable at the moment, but they're not happy. You know, they're looking back at the past, thinking of you, okay? Thinking of you. Let's just see what, I'm just going to see what their real intentions are here. Uh, because I've got the Knight of Swords out. Like I say, Knight of Swords can be um, somebody who's a little bit irritated, bad-tempered. Um, you know the sort of energy someone will start a fight with, a, with themselves or a paper bag. You know that sort of energy. They'll just start a fight with themselves. Okay, so let me just see. Can you tell me, please, what this person's true true intentions are okay what are their true intentions please yeah there's some there's just unfinished business they see you as completing them okay this person knows especially if they ghosted you and they didn't give you any closure. Deep down, they're fully aware that this cycle hasn't closed out. Okay, they feel the cycle. I mean, you might feel the cycle's closed out, but that's the energy I'm getting. They feel that this cycle hasn't closed out. Okay, what else, please? Mm. Okay. Yeah, that I think as an aside here, this person, I was definitely getting Aries. Aries has come out again, so bear that in mind. I think this person's energy I'm picking up on today can be a little bit controlling, okay? They do want to come in and mend some fences, all right? They do want to do that, but they do like things their way. So you'll know this is this reading's for you. This is somebody who can be quite bossy, all right? They they like things done their way, their way or the highway. Uh, stereotypically, it can be somebody who likes to be the boss in the relationship. And going back to what I was picking up a little bit with that Knight of Swords, they have their own viewpoint okay they think though that you should be with them all right they think that you should be with them yeah king of wands they have a vision okay i'm trying the best way to describe what i'm getting this person has a vision for when they come back in and tell, tell you their truth of how it's going to be all right they on a good day are very very um you know f 
focused, they're, they're quite good at leading, etc, etc. And they can really raise somebody's energy on a good day. But if that's not their energy, the flip side of this is they, they come in all hell's blazing, okay, with their plan. And I, I feel at times this person grinds you down because I feel that you're more gentle. Okay, you you see both sides to a story. You you don't judge people. I think this person just goes in hell for leather. Okay, I think they can be a bit hot-tempered, actually, because they've got the King of Wands now. I feel this person can be a little bit hot-tempered. All right. They're definitely, definitely going to come back in with a grand master plan of how they feel it should be. So that is a heads up. So if you, this is your reading and they were somebody who you were with and you just felt that they didn't listen to you or, or your, you weren't heard or your point of view was just sort of, oh, no, no, I've got this, no, we'll do it this way. My way's the best, we're doing it my way. This is your reading, okay? But they are coming back in with that energy, all right? Um, most definitely, definitely coming back in with that energy. I haven't got any cups out here. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to see what's going on in their environment for a minute. I... Just a little, because I haven't, I, I'm just getting a lot of fire and a lot of swords in this reading today. What's going on in this past person's environment, please? Oops, it's too many. Past person's environment. Okay. They have been waiting to come forward for a while, okay? This could have been going on for quite a while now. And when, okay, it was getting early. When they do come in, they're literally just going to get it one morning. There's going to be no plan. You know, that this is not an energy of somebody who plans. This is someone who just wakes up, packs their bag, and moves on, okay? Definitely want a meeting. There's a little bit of anxiety going on in their environment, which I'm just going to clarify. I'm just basically trying to get to the bottom of their, you know, their best intentions, really. What's the anxiety? Regret. They're anxious because this card means a long period of time, which I was, I was getting earlier they're anxious because this has been going on for a while now okay this person could be older than you there could be issues here with elderly parents of some of some description I've got here okay this person is a little bit controlling yeah there's a lot of deception going on in their environment so it could be with elderly parents. Okay, this but again, this reading might be for one person today. I've, I've got with elderly parents here. There's some deception going on, and there was deception going on for a long time. Yeah, they want to reach out to you. They feel that you are their soulmate. Okay, but I feel they have got involved in a karmic situation. All right. Okay, I feel that they've got involved in a karmic situation. I'm definitely getting today something to do with elderly people they're connected into. All right. Okay, something to do with their roots. Okay, they want to tell you the origin of something. Okay, they want to reveal something to you, something about the origin. Let me just see if I can get any other information on what they'd actually like to reveal to you. What would this person like to reveal, please? The 
they regret walking away from you. Okay, they regret it. They realise they had everything. Okay. I really do feel that this could be somebody who just cut. Okay, some, somebody who didn't finish off in a decent and human way. They didn't, they didn't give you decent reasons. It was just all bullshit, okay? And, and then when the going got tough, they just cut, all right? They really regret this. Um, they regret having... I think they were pretty cruel when they left. It's almost like they moved on to something that they were more passionate about, whatever that was, okay? They moved on to something they were more passionate about, but they really do regret that. Yeah. They regret the lies, okay? This person made out, I think they were more than they said they were. But they regret lying to you, in a nutshell. They re regret pulling the wool over your eyes with something. They told you things that weren't true. Totally weren't true. You know, even to the point of they might not have been who they said they were. Not true. Um, they conned you out of something, okay? They, they definitely conned you out of something. Um, but they want to reveal that they regret doing this, okay? I'm just going to see what spirit wants you to know because I'm just a little wary, okay? Just a little wary as to whether they're actually being honest or not, okay? I do feel they will come in with an energy where they will still want to be the leader, okay? They'll still want to be in charge of how the relationship pans out, you know. Even if that's not apparent when they first come back, I think over a period of time, their natural, bossy, my way is the right way personality will come back to the fore, okay? Yeah. They don't like to lose. Okay, there's some, something here they want to win. All right? They want to win at something. You'll know what that is. Okay? I think this person is controlling. I think at times they were emotionally avoidant with you. All right? They could have controlled the finances. They could have actually been really quite tight with money. All right? Money could have been everything to this person and you might not have had your fair share of the money or if you asked for something like you know can you pay for this you know, if you're living together or something they they were always like hanging on to it you know they didn't really want to hand it over okay the energy i've got them coming back in with is all about something in the physical finances money, property, that kind of thing. I'm not getting any real emotion here, okay, which is what I picked up on earlier. I'm not getting any emotion. This is the sort of person who doesn't like to be second best, okay? It is somebody who will run you over with a bus to get you where they want, where, to get themselves where they want to be. They will also make friends with people to, make, to either get them something on the physical, like finances, or to make them look better. I, I do feel this is quite a ruthless energy. This is somebody who will cut people out when they found something better okay 
but they do regret leaving you. But I, I, I do feel there is an element here of them not wanting to lose something, okay? If you're going through a, a financial battle or, or, you know, something to do with your assets with this person, you will, I feel, come out successful in the end. But I do feel that your person, they don't want to lose some money. They're very, very, they can be really quite selfish, okay? They like all their possessions, all right? They like their possessions. I feel that they do like to keep you a little bit, I do feel they like to keep you a little bit trapped. Or they'd like to keep you a little bit trapped. You know, I feel that you broke out of this, okay? They... I feel this is quite a controlling person, all right? I feel they're gonna come back in and say, yeah, they've got these regrets and wish it had never happened. And they want to tell you some truth, but their energy is one of, very possession orientated you know they've got their energy is possession all right they I'm just getting an element of control all right that's what I'm getting that they don't want to lose it's almost like this person views people as possessions all right and they will say what they need to say do what they need to do to get what they view as their possession back and probably quite nice for a while but then after a while their real personality shines through okay by which time they've almost got the person back where they want them all right so that is i think an important message if, if this is your reading today yeah there's somebody who doesn't want to lose something Especially if you've recently refound your independence, okay? Or they think that you're going to come into something on the physical level, all right? I feel further down the line, they will revert possibly back to this emotional avoidance, okay? Where for a while they will be okay, but then they will start almost shutting down again. Okay, let me just see what spirit let's see what spirit wants you to know. Let's see. Let's get this stuck out. Hmm. Oh, spirit, please. Okay. That was pretty to the point. Take a break from all of this. Four of swords. Okay. Be the Four of Swords, all right? Be prepared for this, but, you know, protect your own interests first. You know, if, if you're in no communication at the moment, it's almost a card that says, just wait and see. Just wait and see, because there's still this element for you of heartbreak hanging over you, okay? I think there's a brighter day dawning for you, but you're still very tired, and that's what I was getting earlier on. You know, this person grounds you down with their, um, their bossiness, really. Take a rest, okay? Take a rest, that's what Spirit's saying today. Just um, keep yourself to yourself and don't, don't put yourself back into the heartbreak again and on the other hand don't put yourself back into all that you know winner takes it all kind of energy all right you protect you here because i feel for who this is for today you are tired you're tired right let's just see what the best possible outcome is please best possible outcome here Okay, the decision will 
rest with you. Your energies come out. It's up to you. Okay. It's up to you whether you agree to communicate with this person. I think when this person comes back in, the decision will be yours. Whether to break no contact, whether to um, allow them to speak their truth, or whether just to keep them blocked. Okay? The decision rests with you. But I will say, this is lovely, whatever decision you make, you will be happy with it. Okay? I feel, I feel you will be happy with the decision you know and by happy I mean that I think you'll be so happy that you've been able to stand up for yourself against this person because that's what this outcome is it's you taking charge taking leadership taking ownership and saying actually no I'm the one that calls the shots now okay so it, it's a very disconnected energy but on the whole the decision the decision will rest with you and it will be you that has the power okay it's you that's going to win your you whatever is going on here whatever got whatever has gone on you're going to win you're you're going to win this okay yeah you're going i think you're going to walk away yeah you're going to win this okay this is um this is beautiful and again going back to what i was saying if you're any sort of asset division, all that kind of stuff, you are going to come out on top and you're going to walk away from this. Okay, you're going to walk away from this. But they, they will come back in, you know, with sweet sweet memories of the past. That's what I'm, I'm getting they're going to be saying. But I, I feel for who this is for today, honestly, I think you're just going to keep on walking. But this time you're going to have almost the final say. You could even just have the final say. So you might be best at the moment by by not saying anything at all. Um, there's that song, I can't think of the words exactly. You know, it's better, you do best when you say nothing at all kind of energy. So anyway, I hope that has helped somebody today. Thank you so, so much for watching. And thank you so much for all your likes, comments, subscribes. Take good care of yourself and remember you are irreplaceable. Okay, like I say in every video, you really, really are. Okay, sending you loads and loads of love. Speak to you soon. Bye.